News 46 weather is brought to you by your local dairy farmers. Dairy products are very important in maintaining a healthy body. Hello and welcome back to News 46. Today is Monday, September 28th. Today we had partly cloudy skies with a high of 95 degrees. Your average temperature on this time of year is 85 degrees. Winds were coming from the south today at 8 miles per hour with gusts up to 17 miles per hour. The mix today was 4, which is moderate. Humidity was at 12% today. Sunrise was at 637 this morning and the record high back in 2010 was 103 degrees. Well, tonight we'll have partly cloudy skies with a low of 67 degrees. Your average temperature around this time of year is 56 degrees. Winds will be coming from the southeast this evening at 4 miles per hour with gusts up to 8 miles per hour. Humidity will be at 21%. Sunset will be at 634 this evening. And the record low back in 1971 was 37 degrees. Tomorrow we'll have sunny skies with a high of 97 degrees and a low of 66 degrees. Winds will be coming from the south at 6 miles per hour with gusts up to 10 miles per hour. Humidity will be at 17 percent. Sunrise will be at 638 tomorrow morning and the UV index will be 7, which is high. And for our 7-day forecast, we have sunshine all the way across the board. Your high temperatures will be starting off at 97 degrees tomorrow. That will be going up to 98 on Wednesday. And it will start to work its way down, hitting 90 degrees next Sunday and Monday. Your low temperatures will be looking at a similar pattern starting off at 66 degrees. That will rise up to 68 degrees on Wednesday. And then work its way down to 57 degrees on Sunday, rising slightly to 59 degrees next Monday. Thanks so much, Noah. Now the temperatures start going down. Well, we have a long fall festival weekend from Thursday all the way through last night. Uh, we cleaned up the park and all done. The parade was fantastic. It's being aired again tonight at 7 p.m. here on 46.1. So you want to definitely watch the parade once again. And I want to thank everybody involved in it, including, and of course, the Prompt Valley Chamber of Commerce. You guys did a great job. I'm a little dehydrated. My, horse, my throat is a little hoarse, but uh, we're going to recover and we're back to news. So that's going to do it for this edition of News 46 from everyone up here at KPVM-TV and KA's Country Radio. Have a great night. We'll see you back here tomorrow.